<clears throat> All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chan. And I just realized I should have been uh, taking these vitamin C tablets. Uh, took a look at that yesterday. I'm actually kind of uh, still a little sick. Mm. But I'm feeling much better today. Despite the fact that I uh, only got four hours of sleep last night. Yes, four hours. Maybe four and a half. And it's only because it's like, oh, my body just doesn't want to go to bed. It's like, how do I have so much energy? Because yesterday, I actually took in about 1,800 calories and I was lifting weight. So it's well below what I should be doing. All right. So I'm thinking, okay, I guess I must be losing a little more weight. So I have to reduce my calorie intake even further, you know, while still building more muscle. And I still have the body fat in my stomach, so I, I don't know. But, um... I mean, if you're, if you're not tired, then you just wake up. Mm. So. Mm. Mm. So for the most part, so far so good. Hopefully, of course, I wish I could say the same about crypto, but I mean, it's well within norms. Because right? I was hoping, I was hoping this bull run would be different this time. So far, it's been acting exactly like it had always has in the past. Which means uh, we're on track to go up sometime around November and December, which, funny enough, will be the election, right? Let's see. Wow. Trump is now behind uh, 8%. So I think in my YouTube descriptions, I'm going to include uh, the predictives. i got to try to make a mental note of it. In fact... Um, at this rate, at this rate, the market, Joe Biden is going to, okay, yeah, so one thing I have to start considering is if Trump loses this year, I'm going to have to make some adjustments as well. I just hope the short-term market shock of a new president isn't going to um, go too crazy. Because, uh, I mean, the problem is at that point we'll have, a, we'll have a full martial law, military, police state. Democrats will be in full control. The fake right's going to continue doing their stupid asshole racist anti-China bullshit. All right. In fact, um, I don't want to mention the asshole's name, but I actually decided he's looking at Twitter. And just as recently as yesterday, he was just saying, all oh, Chinese people are racist. So I'm surprised he didn't get banned on Twitter for that. But, yeah. Person hasn't changed. And this person's also directly already negatively impacting Mike Cernovich, too. Because uh, Mike Cernovich did a periscope, and he actually said, oh, again, I don't want to mention the asshole's name. Stupid racist piece of shit. Uh, he said, I got into a heated argument with him, but I wanted to give it up. Yeah, I mean, I knew, I figured this out immediately. This asshole, not Mike Turner, but the person that I'm not naming. Yeah, he has no forgiveness, even though he tells around, tells people, yeah, be a Christian, forgive people. Then he turns right around and does the complete opposite. He's, in fact, encouraging people. And is now in, uh, is starting to infect Nick Fuentes and Mike Turner with his, you know, very negative anti-Christian view. And it's very bad. It's very bad. AI match accounts. I actually am quite interested in this ad. <laughs> See, people are interested in ads if you make them good and relevant. But um, yeah, it's gonna get pretty bad. Um, you know, war with China. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I still don't know why the Republicans seem to have some giant fucking dildo sharp butt plug up their ass about China. I mean, the only thing I know is China probably is not funding the Republican Party, right? Because the Republicans get their money from somewhere else. But I guess that's why God and Congress has decided, yeah, maybe the Republicans don't deserve power anymore. You know, based on what I've seen personally. So I'm like, well, shit. You and I are like the last ones. Of the, you know, we're like the Jedi in a way. So, I mean, Nick Fuentes and the Gorkers will hold out for a while. Of course, I'll support them. But, I mean, they're, they're going to be fighting a losing battle at that point. Especially if the person that... Uh, that I will not name, infects him completely with his anti-Christian shit, but that's disguised as Christianity. That will, that, then it's over. Then it's over. So, 
I don't know. I'm gonna be uh, today's my today's my fiscal day off, right? Uh, no weights. Uh, let me type that in. No weights. Uh, six three. You should really get sticky notes on your Windows computer. It's uh, very handy. Uh, did I send money to my Crex and South Exchange? Yes, I did. So yeah. But anyway, uh, I don't know. We're gonna have some transitions. Of course, all of you that <clears throat> despise Donald Trump, yeah, you'll be happy in the short term. But just know that it's gonna cause us problem. All of us, uh, a lot of problems right after. So, but you know, that's just how it goes. You know. The Infinite Game says that the game will go on forever. So, there'll just be new players, there'll be new pol uh, influencers, and new blah 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 blah. Alright, so Bitcoin searches for this week have been released. It's now at 12, so of course the normies have just abandoned Bitcoin, uh, as they always do. Dominance is at 65%, 24 hour volume is 114.2 billion. So, again, very, very modest. Uh, Bitcoin's back down 9605, so big up and a big dump. So it's a small little, it's a mini pump and dump. <clears throat> As you can see across the board, it's pretty much up and down. It's down the same amount everywhere. Litecoin's at 4683. Doggy coin is at 319.5 million. Market capo. Um, hmm. These Kirkland Signature Vitamin C chewables are so good and they're so cheap. And you get like 500 of them off of Amazon. Mm. Since it's Kirkland Signature, you could probably get it off of um, Costco whenever you go there too. Mm. <coughs> Steam is at 20.4. What? Oh, okay. I was like, why is Steam above Hive? And then I realized it's sorted by market cap, because, duh. So, uh, Steam is actually above Hive in market cap, but it's worth 20.49 cents, whereas Hive is 24.62 cents. Yep. So, not bad, not bad. All right, let me refresh this one more time, make sure we get the up-to-date stuff. So, yesterday was an update, I think. Because <coughs> uh, as soon as I... <coughs> Because as soon as I finish these videos, I don't look at the market data anymore because there's no point. Uh, but uh, the Dow's up a little, the S&P's up a little, uh, NASDAQ is pretty well lost too. Um, after S&P's 40% surge. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's take a look at whatever this is. Uh, this looks like a scam. Too good to be true. Very good ad though, so they're probably pulling in a lot of suckers. Stocks focus on reopenings despite... By the way, that's why I, I do proof of stake mining like this. <laughs> why is this on Litecoin? Oh, that's right, because the 404 coin is uh, disabled and corrects while they... Because wait, I haven't received an email from them yet. So let me see. Um... Yeah, so they uh, disabled it on the thing. So, I'm just gonna have to wait for him to finish. Yeah, so basically the reopenings are being priced in. Everyone already knows the negative data. So the interesting thing is the chaos. Corporations are getting richer no matter what's happening. And they also kind of know that Trump's going to get kicked out of the office, as we see over here. So, I don't know. This could be the one time where I might actually say if Joe Biden wins, the economy might actually continue to hum along. At least the stock markets will continue to hum along just fine. I mean, uh, of course, I can't say the same for white Americans or the rural people, especially the ones that are high on drugs and shit. <clears throat> this you know got a drug epidemic so yeah it's uh, gonna be pretty nutty gonna be pretty nutty now this is the time oh god i'm so sick and tired of hearing these stupid riots and shit uh goldman sachs tapers go for a stock market drop uh no don't care warner music group prices ip at 25 bucks a share to raise uh, almost two billion dollars now the only reason why i want to read this is because one day i want to make my own entertainment company and one thing i could consider is also going to music uh, the problem is, it's going to be hard to do. 
I mean, I'm probably, I'm probably at that point going to have to hire an actual ex-music executive or something so we can start getting rights. Because at this point, because at that point, I probably won't have a choice. I'll have to actually uh, work with the unions and shit, right? But that's only for the music group. My acting stuff, right, is my stuff will definitely still be non-union. So at least I'll have me control of that. <clears throat> Warner Music Group prices IPO at 25, buck, uh, 25 bucks a pop to raise $1.925 billion. Warner Music Group Corp priced its initial IPO on Wednesday at 25 a share. Uh, one thing, one other thing I may consider is I probably will start uh, asking for, I'll probably put out, I'll have to put out some sort of code. <clears throat> I'll probably put out some sort of code where I'll want to hire like actual actors, like the ones you see in the movies, but then uh, I can't name names, right? So I'll probably just tell Variety or Hollywood Reporter Hey, uh, I will ask you to do FICOR then at that point, or something like that. And then I'll just leave it at that, and then people will be able to... Because I assume all the actors in Hollywood at least read Variety and Hollywood Reporter, and they're always on the scalp. Because people are like, yeah, well, what the hell is this? Oh, it took me to a new page. I hate, I hate this. Well, I need to read the story, so we'll dump that over there. So it'll be like... Yeah, you know, they'll just do it on their table. Yeah, SAG will get mad, Screen Actors Guild. They'll get mad, but, you know, what are they going to do? It's FICOR. All right, so since I opened up Market Watch, and then there's nothing here. All right, so I don't know what's wrong with JMC Coin on Crex, so let me see if I can find out what it is on Chrome. Right now, it's 7 sub-Satoshi. It's probably 7 to, what, 12? And 2x2 two two coin is 73 Satoshis of a Bitcoin to 75 so it's going very strong and this has a like eleven hundred dollars of trade uh, 24 hour trip <coughs> 24 hour trade volume. i hate being sick it is so annoying so uh i assume it's because 404 is not on crux at least old 404 until they finish the swap process um so i don't know but they said it would take up to two weeks so you know we'll, we'll see how how they handle it Cow pound coin is five thousand to fifty seven hundred, and of course we're right, we're waiting for their emails, so like you know they uh, you know so we could you know uh, help them with the swap. Uh, thank you to the one person that subscribed. So thank you, thank you very much. You know, we're slowly growing this channel because it's so irritating to me to see all these fake assholes, especially on the fake right, get so big off of their stupid shit, and then you know I'm still left walling in uh, in the back. But I made a commitment to the truth and you know well guess what that means you know i don't get anything else well, luckily god's taking good care of me it's just gonna give me a lot of money so and, and then a lot of talent so i just have to like as always i have to do everything myself so of course with your help but you know, it's just gonna take some time Whoa, the Bitcoin coin make crashes and suddenly uh, coinbase repeats pairs shining down when bitcoin blah blah, blah. yeah coinbase always does that uh, but I think it's, again, it's because they do a fiat. So I forgot how they explain it, but basically, when the, when there's a huge price swing to the downside, uh, what happens is Coinbase has to redeem people people's money. Let's say Bitcoin's at say ten thousand five hundred, like it was yesterday, and it crashes to like ninety five hundred. So that's a thousand dollars loss. Well. Well, because there's a lag time between crypto to fiat, there in that lag time. Coinbase is responsible for that one thousand dollar gap. So when you're dealing with billions of dollars for you know with a B, that thousand dollars per Bitcoin, and you got like I don't know how many Bitcoins flows through Coinbase, you know, every day, right? Like a million. That's a lot. That's a million times a thousand. That's a one billion dollar potential loss right there due to lag, and that could really screw up uh, Coinbase. So. It's probably less than a billion, obviously, but it's it's a significant sum of money. That that's why Coinbase constantly shuts their shit off. Uh, I've never heard of the others doing the same thing either. Um, so, uh, Wacko, be high, Bitcoin prices their own thing in May. Bitcoin test ten k again. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I mean, right now there's still too much chaos. So I guess Bitcoin does not want to go because I was like, I was like a little, I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, it's going up, but like, there's nothing fundamentally different. 
Uh, let's see. Ripple chief meets with Brazil central bank despite coronavirus. Anbex says Bitcoin targets 300k with or without invest. Okay, I might actually be interested in reading this. So we'll put that there. Um, of course. Uh, ah, jeez. Okay. What? I did not click that. What is what is going on here? Okay. Uh, there we go. Okay, so this is the article, stock market news. Whale alert. Ethereum cryptocurrency must expand beyond the world of finance. Yeah, I mean, of course. I mean, it already is. But, you know, we, we got to get our search somewhere. U.S. China tide is rising. New round of saying it could impact Bitcoin crypto markets. Ah, this was from yesterday. <clears throat> All right. So we already looked at that, Trump. Oh yeah, I already looked at it, the, the thing offline. So uh, yeah, Trump's just tweeting like an idiot as always. Um, yeah, so yeah, we're on track for June 8th reopening. All right, so this might actually explain a little bit of what's happening. Uh, let's see, well, it could always lead to a full blow of financial. It's like, well, post control China freeze assets, China, and business, probably new uh, national security threat. Well, it could show right of Hong Kong citizens. What? It's likely that the U.S. Treasury Department will post controls on transactions and freeze assets of Chinese officials, CCP, and businesses for implementing a new... Uh, oh, okay, they're targeting China for China being an asshole towards Hong Kong. Okay, I got it. Add to that is the main... And China actually is a big component of our American FDI, foreign direct investment. I was thinking about it and it was brushing my teeth. And uh, yeah, that might actually make a lot of sense. Where we're talking tens of billions, deca billions at least. Because um, again, when I moved into this apartment a few... Wow, well, it's been a few years now. Um, my real estate agent told me when we were talking about, you know, getting rich and, you know, buying commercial real estate, whatever, right? He told me that, yeah, when you go to these commercial real estate stuff... It's only uh, Jews, Hasidic Jews, and Chinese investors. And I was like, what? <laughs> Chinese investors and where's all the... And, then, and I also asked, where are all the black and Hispanic people? And he just didn't answer that part. <laughs> he just told me about the Chinese investors. I guess because he didn't want to sound racist. So I, I totally understand, especially nowadays. Because uh, my real estate agent was actually Jewish. So, but, you know... Uh, he obviously looks white, so you know you, you can't be too careful with these things, right? You know, so I mean, he's both white and is Jewish, so he's got to worry about uh, about people hating him for two times the reason, the two time force in CD. Uh, America, God, how, how did we make it this far? Despite all our problems. Oh well, but yeah. Um, point is, yeah, China, uh, China is a very huge FDI uh, component. So, okay, I mean, I could believe that, but it, yeah, it's like, eh, twenty four trade volume overall is just well, well within the minimum norms. Not even the norm, like the medium, but like the low end of the norm. So, you know, but it's, it's interesting just to keep in mind because this definitely will have an impact for sure. Uh, I didn't mean Mr. Freeze, you know, U.S. Free Russia with Marcus Williams, which seems to hit the efforts to get China bond and key territory regarding the chase coming around in the U.S. market. Yeah, well, good luck with that. Because I will admit, uh, China owns 25, like, basically 30% of our food production in America, so they could ship it off to China or wherever. It's like, yeah, if people did not have a reason to hate Chinese people, that is going to eventually piss people off. Uh, sure, because... Uh, you know, no food. Uh, luckily, the food chain's working just fine, so at least when I go to Target, it's fine. Sherman notes that Neil can introduce holding foreign companies to Kamal Act is not designed to get Chinese companies delisted from American markets, but rather force them to adhere to existing standards in the capital market. Probably not to delist the United it's demand China to do what other whatever had done agree that if their company wants to partner in the U.S. capital markets, they agree to live by U.S. capital market rules. Time for like China to blink first for the Benefit of investors. What the hell? They're not even under jurisdiction. I assume they were under jurisdiction. What the hell is this? Oh man, it's gonna suck because Joe Biden's gonna reverse all this shit. Oh god, my head. 
Uh, it's the largest economy in the world where international trades transacted with the U.S. dollar deals with China you know, could have a severe impact on the Chinese economy, causing China to seek uh, alternative assets like crypto to hedge their portfolios. Yeah, crypto is not banned in China, despite uh, what you're told. The Dovi Wan lady on Twitter is really good about that. In fact, we actually did the Bitcoin video on that a while ago. Sure, we call it Collins in 2019 outlaw crypto on the grounds uh, that they threatened to disappear from American for a roll up. How the guy would uh, add more pressure exhibited to you? See, this is just bad karma, right? This is why the fucking Republicans are going to just lose. Maybe this guy's a Democrat, but this, is, this, this Sherman F word. Regardless of whether in China investor, Chinese investors and in other countries can add US dogs for the religious Chinese shingle. Dollar fresh as a result of immense money price by like the Fed can also lead investors to other options like gold and crypto, suggests author Robert Kiyosaki. Oh, uh, yeah, so he's just making the rounds again. I mean, crypto is, is basically the Zoomer or young or millennial generations of gold for boomers, but crypto is still better than gold simply because you're going to make way more off of crypto. And on top of that, we're go if I have a gold bar, I'm still going to have a gold bar after one year. But if I have these proof of stake coins, I'm going to have way more value than one fucking gold bar rotting in my apartment. Not to mention, it makes me less of a uh, a robbery risk. <clears throat> uh, another key Bitcoin manager, cryptocurrency venture run by the Winkle Boss Brothers Department with Samsung. Oh, yeah, we already read that from like yesterday. Blah, 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 blah. Samsung's uh, smartphone market is at 18% on par Apple. Yeah, my next phone is definitely is very likely going to be a Samsung Galaxy Note. I think that's their latest models. But, I mean, I'm not going to... Right now, um, I'm, I'm just using this shitty... Well, it's not shitty, but it's just old and obsolete. But I had to pay 250 for this phone. So I'm like, come on. Stock market news line. Stock to rise is a shake off on rest. So it allows the 80... Okay. Uh, stocks extend gains in Worcester sector such a more major. How's Remmel doing? Uh, I know it's doing well, up 23 cents, 7.16. All right, good. So it's well on its way back to 27 or 29 dollars. So I'll have my stock market account back to 115k, and it's going to be pretty nice. Stocks so taking a major the near term coronavirus, more dollar economic figures are scored a down drop of the coronavirus. But how are markets struggle up to date, which is the day I spent me, Wall Street could not expect private. Sector Jazz, a lot of total nine other month. Oh my god. Alright, I'm about to skip this article. Uh, okay, there's still. Uh, so you have to be careful how I say this, so I don't get bad on YouTube. But uh, they're still pushing the mass hysteria bullshit. So, uh, okay. We're just going to act. Right. That was a nothing article. Uh, okay. Warner Music Group prices IP are 25 bucks a pop. Hmm. Uh, you know, I just realized I read all that shit. Oh, yeah, the China. Yeah, I was trying to remember. What was I talking about before? It was the China trade real tension stuff. Well, that's, that's always going to be tensions. Warner Music Group price it's an IPO at twenty five bucks a pop. The higher end of the day uh, increased the size of the deal from seventy seven to one hundred eight. The company raised almost two billion after asking its manager to delay price in two days. The music industry took a pause from regular regular act. I think that he means regular activity. It's for solidarity. Uh, Atlantic Records, Warner Records, and Electric Records. Okay. Um, Okay, they got a bunch of other banks. Stock will trade on NASDAQ later Wednesday with a ticker signal WMG. That would be today. Uh, what? Okay, because I really don't want to override this, but I guess we'll override this. Because today is Wednesday. Okay, um, I guess it's not active yet. Oh, and that's the end of the thing. Hmm. See, entertainment's got a lot of money, but I mean, these guys also do a lot of hard work, too, so. Hmm. Okay. All right, we'll end it on this. Uh, how long are you? Okay, it's a short article. Yeah, all right, we can use this as a... Um... Actually... Oh, that's a really ugly. Because I wanted something with the U.S. China tension relations as a thumbnail, but we'll just stick with this. Bitcoin target 300k with or without the rich people. Uh, Adam Beck says, "Believe you too." I don't know about that, but it would definitely help at least. 
Griffin Water said, I mean, I just figure the bull run will not be nearly as big as it will be if the rich people don't jump in. Uh, Beck. Oh, his name is Adam Beck. That Adam Beck. Says he believes retail LO could push Bitcoin at 300k. Well, they're definitely, they definitely have the stupidity uh, uh, to do it. And a low impulse control, aka impatience. It is a bloomer crypto part says a big believer in Bitcoin to this day. He's still making top crypto, never sells his holdings. Back, back, uh, back of correspondence with Satoshi himself, who created a proof of work system for Bitcoin's event. It points to the coronavirus increasing printing of cash. Yeah, I mean, coronavirus is, I mean, there's going to be a lot of excuses for people to just stay at home uh, and do everything on the internet. So uh, digital money is just going to be just is the solution uh and in fact even with things opening up a lot of people polled said they uh, 40 percent of people respondents did say they will avoid large crowds so yeah well that being said eventually it'll be summer it'll be july it'll be all it'll be so hot you're, you're gonna want to go out so also i think people are just really frazzled and the riots aren't uh, helping things either because uh, the current virus causing worry, I'll think about hedging. Are we telling Valen when there's a lot of money printing in the world? First of all, most people don't give a shit about Because right now, we printed a lot of money and nobody talks about it. So, the, the typical normie person doesn't care. Chris is saying that he is the legendary not carrier of Bitcoin. No, I'm not. Jerry Miller has this fight as better than the is not known. Uh, excuse me. I gotta make sure I burp out the vitamin C. Because I don't get hiccups. Okay. If you have a hierarchical mindset, because Bitcoin is more like digital gold, you wouldn't want to have gold. To have... Because Bitcoin is more like a digital gold, you wouldn't want gold to have a founder. For Bitcoin to keep a commodity like procession, I think it's very good that Satoshi stays out of public. Well, even if he comes out on the fruition, it's decentralized. It's 100% decentralized itself, right? You know, if I have the Bitcoin wallet, I mean, I, you can't shut me out of it. I, I mean, fucking Hamas and Al-Qaeda is using Bitcoin. And like, <laughs> I mean, what more than needs to be said, you know? So, but yeah, it's fine. Uh, so this was just more of like a fluff article. Uh, there's nothing of substance. All right. So anyway, like what you saw, read or heard, hit like button, the follow button, or subscribe button from where you're watching this from, or on my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash JFC Radio. Uh, make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page so we can continue uh, growing this channel. All right, so uh, obviously I've done for the day. Uh, that was like an or, or ordinary size video, but all right, we're chugging along. But anyway, everything's basically normal. Things are getting better. Obviously, I was hoping Bitcoin would be like a super duper bull rush, but eh, it's doing what it normally does. So ah, I guess we're gonna have to wait for the big money at the end of this year, right? So. Yeah, I mean, I guess that means I would. Oh, I, I, God, I don't want to sell crypto at what's Bitcoin? What was Bitcoin at? Forty-seven dollars. Yeah, it's like forty-seven dollars a piece. Yeah, but I don't know. I guess we'll see. I mean, yeah, I mean, uh, as much as I like to criticize Trump, he's figured it out way too late, and I think the damage has been done. So I don't know. Maybe Jerry Kushner was deliberately feeding Trump bad advice so when Trump goes to jail and maybe the Trump sons go to jail Jared Kushner will commandeer the entire Trump family net worth and that'll be that you know literally stealing everything from Donald Trump so but yeah it's an eight percent gap uh, anyway uh, we'll see you all tomorrow's video thanks for watching stay safe try to avoid the um, the riots and shit unless you're a rioter yourself and obviously you're still gonna try to keep safe uh, you really shouldn't be rioting, you know, it's a very evil thing to do, right? You know, because a lot of minorities, the people that you rioters claim to support are actually suffering very badly from, not from the one-two punch of the rioting, the looting, and the coronavirus shutdown. So you're, you're, you're hurting all of us. So stop, stop doing that, right? There's a reason why I don't like liberals. Unfortunately, uh, Conservatives are actually much worse than liberals, mostly because of a lack of empathy and creativity, which go hand in hand. So we're stuck with fucking uh, liberals and Joe Biden for president for the next eight fucking years uh, at the rate things are going. Like, Trump is not only going to lose, but he's going to lose in a landslide, which is just, just, 
<sighs> you could not figure out a bigger way to lose in the worst possible way. It would be like if Trump lost to Jeb Bush. All right, that's how bad it's gonna. This is like just. And then no one really retweeted my, you know, conspiracy about the shutdowns, where like the deep state wants the shutdowns to happen because we're not gonna have uh, we're not gonna have national debates live in public. It's gonna be televised on TV. On the internet, Joe Biden's gonna is gonna look totally normal. Like Trump's charm is just gonna be crap, right? I mean, the gap is gonna just be neutralized, right? Because Joe Biden doesn't need to do anything except follow directions. So he'll have all his helpers behind the camera just feeding him answers. Oh well. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching. I got more things to think about. Oh, I did. Uh, the song Tang guy did respond. Yes, we fixed the bug. I just have to re-enable something called game like. The disc I didn't say this because I didn't want to piss him off, but the the option they told me to turn back on was turned off because I read the description and it sounded like I needed it off, but that's why everything was breaking down. I turned it back on and simple check mark and everything's working fine. So thank God because I was bashing my head in. So and I'm going to be giving up Tarkov, so it's it's just not fun for me anymore for now. <clears throat> So, you know, I have more free time, play my Hades start, and then, uh, you know, um, I think today I'll probably take another day off, and then I'll go back to reading and working on the game. So, yeah, uh, I mean, it's over. Politics is over. Uh, and from what I see with the fake conservatives and fake Christians, it's over, too. It's over for the Republicans. Uh, Nick Fuentes and the Gorper Uprising will be the last remnants of the Republican Party. Uh, and, then one, and then at that point, I should have both my tower defense game and my clash of clan game uh, out, and then hopefully I'll be able to implement a real story, ish. And then, uh, then, then I'll find, and then I'll, and then I'll know for a fact if there is a chance, right? It's too late for Donald Trump at the rate things are going, simply because he's just too stupid. Uh, too, too, he's too much of an uh, unempathetic asshole, and it's killing him. He's, 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 he's getting killed with empathy, or in this his case, lack of empathy. I will not make that. I don't make that mistake. All right. That's why a lot of people like me. Uh, other people don't like me if they tend to be liberal. But that's because obviously I'm um, slamming the shit libs. But I mean, at the end of the day, you know, if you're a liberal but you're nice, yeah, yeah, we'll get along just fine. All right. You know, hey, I'm not the one that's fucking rioting and raping and pillaging and shooting and killing people. All right. It's the other people doing that shit. Anyway, see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Judson Chan, GMC coin, 404 coin. Um, the wallet is actually off on Crex. Uh, I have not received. Uh, Mitch is probably awake. I have not received anything from Crex. So uh, if I had to guess, I think Crex is just going to have today just nothing. And then tomorrow is when they'll start. I mean, I don't know what the, what their procedure is with a swap, but they'll they'll get it done. All right, they'll get it done. In the meantime, just use BTC pop in all the uh, staking pools. And they will uh, do uh, the swapping for you. So here's our thumbnail and yada yada.